trials of mana. Uh-oh. Are we live? Is this thing on? Hello? Hello? Try Hello out the there? Game. Let's play this game. I'm John. Welcome back to the D-Pad. If you're here, you've probably seen all the other episodes. I love you all. The world in California is tilted. Yes, it is. My camera is a little messed up, but I didn't want to slow things down by trying to fix it. Um... Let's see. What's going on? What's going on? Hey, Golux. Hey, Alexbert. Hey, SD Hero. Um, thank you guys for being here. A little bit of a late start today. I blame Rick personally. I'm sure he's listening. Um, and if so, I blame you. Um, <laughs> so it's actually crazy. I was uh, running around all day and all weekend. and uh, Dutch Anglefornia is my favorite state. Yeah, I recently learned I'm Dutch. So that's... Not recently. I mean, I've always known I was a little Dutch, but apparently I'm more Dutch than I realized. So, it's my native angle, I suppose you could say. Let's see if I can get my... It's definitely still tilted, but at least it's, like, my head is in frame, which is something. Um, how are you guys doing today? Let's play this. We're running a little late, so I'm going to jump right in and um, try to get my bearings while we talk. Hey, Champster, thanks for stopping by. I wish you could be here more. Someday you won't have to cut animals into other pieces of animals or whatever you said the other night that I found hilarious. Um, and uh, we can do more time. We can spend more time working on this kind of shit. So, good luck with work. The Champster's job sounds pretty brutal. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm lucky that I don't have a job that makes me get up at 4 a.m. and then close the next day. Um, what were we doing? We're obviously, something's going to happen here. Did, uh, we did get Salamander. So now we need to figure out what's going on. Um, let's think. I assume you guys made me power everyone up. Let's just... Aha, no. All right, so what does this guy need? Charger. Charge attack damage increases by... No, that's lame. Let's give him the other one. It would be spirit. Oh, I can't give him more spirit. Well, shit, then we're back to strength. Um, 
Time to blow this volcano stand. All right, unless anyone tells me not to, I'm just gonna put all this stuff in strength. Um, I'm also gonna take a second to make my screen bigger because it's so small I can't read any of the voids. Um, yeah, yeah, cool. Learn charger. Okay, so gonna do this. Gonna do this. Oh, way better. Okay. Awesome. Cool. No, I don't want to equip it. And what about young Reese? Nothing. All right. So let's get the hell out of here. Wee. Well, that was short. Um, I'm a little concerned, guys, because I'm going to be traveling to New England soon. And I have to quarantine for two weeks, and I'm not going to have my PS4. So I think I can figure out how to do the cloud save thing so that when I get to the D-pad, I can use that PS4 and stream from there. But for the two weeks in between, we might have to take a quick break. So we'll have to think about what makes sense to do for that. Maybe I just take the time off and enjoy being on vacation or quarantation or whatever we want to call it. Um, but, but yeah, I don't want to slow down the momentum on this too much because it's a long game and we're making good progress. But I don't really want to bring my giant PS4 Pro with me if I can avoid it. Although maybe I can, because I'm going to have to check a bag anyway, because I'm going to be there for months. So I might just do it. So we'll see. No no decision is made as of right now. Where the hell am I going? So yeah, let's see. Um, Alex, wait, when you say you guess it kind of works out, what do you mean? Duran's a charger now. He can get your smartphone. It's funny you say that. My, my smartphone is nearly dead. I don't want to fight you idiots. Going down here, I guess. Somebody's discording me. Ooh, free shit. Yay, a candy. Um, I will, I will fight stuff. I don't know. I just felt like avoiding them for some reason. Um, yeah, Alex, when you said kind of works out, did you mean something? Like, are you also disappearing for two weeks, or? Honey elixir. Or were you talking about something totally different? go... is there like a shortcut? Like, can I just... nope? Okay. Oh, the eggs. I hate the eggs. None of the petrification stuff, please. Thank you. I don't like it. Oh, nice. Oh, she's so good. How, do you, how am I supposed to navigate this? By jumping, right? Egatrices are... Clidulip? Cute, though. Yes. They're also Clidulip. Grew into Pricklebeak. Fucking awesome. <laughs> oh, shoot. Was that the super strong one? Did I just waste a bunch of MP on that? Let's see. I've got... Yep. A little bit more than I would have liked to have spent, but that's fine. Ooh, is he gold? Is he like a shiny? Careful. Gold boulette? I don't remember what their weakness is. But I want to say wind? Oh, and I'm dead. Oh, right, but they have the shield. Come on. Oh, there he is. I was like, what happened to the other one? Boom, right in the back. Oh, he had a shield on too, huh? Thanks for healing me, Durin, three hours later. Got him. All right. A one. A one! Those don't really look that much like bullets. I'm sure it's just... Is it bullet? 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 Bullette? What is it meant to be? I don't know. Um, maybe mixed with Triceratops and Ankylosaurus. Yeah, they do look a little bit more dinosaur-y than bullet -y. Land sharks. Boule. Is that right, Envy? I wouldn't, I wouldn't be surprised, honestly. Um, it's boule. We 
Gotta charge it. Clunk. No, not on you guys. You guys get that one. And that murders you. And that. There we go. Okay. It could be pronounced bullet, but the official. Right. Interesting. So if it was a real French word, it would be boulet. Is that right? There's a final Monster Hunter update coming in a Mike Director. Oh, there it is. Okay, that's cool. Let's get moving. It'd be boulet. Oh, okay, cool. So they, so TSR incorrectly pronounces it boulet. Got it. Like Robert Goulet. Um, I'm just checking my Discord to make sure everything's okay. Ah, oh, okay, cool. It's um. Okay, cool, cool. It's just Arrow. Talk to him more later. Oh no, I thought this was the way to get to the star, but it was just misleading, and now there's a treasure chest. A cup of witches. Et is pronounced T A. Is it? That's what I thought. Okay, cool. So someone at TSR was like, Boule, but they were wrong. Got it. But I do think, I wish I, oh, I have that book I was talking about, um, Borges' Imaginary Beasts and Creatures or whatever it is. It's his bestiary, and um, I want to look it up because I'm pretty sure bullets are in there. So, like, it's not an original TSR creation. Not that anything is an original TSR creation, am I right? Am I right? There we go. I'm turning them all into no shield ninnies so that I can use some aggressive wind magic and hopefully just get some collateral damage on each of them. The gold ones are tougher, though. Oh, I'm out of juice. Anybody want to heal? Okay, fine. I'll do it myself. Y'all are not helpful teammates. What's the thing that gives me MP? Am I out of the thing that gives me MP? Walnut, right? No walnuts? Or do I have them just not equipped? I wonder if that's it. Well, looks like it's time to get physical. Physical. I'm here all week. Thanks, everyone. Same with the owl bear. Oh, wow. Yeah. Uh, in 5e, e. apparently the D&D ones are supposed to be a magical crossbeat of Snapping Turtle and Armadillo. Yikes. A thing nobody was like, oh, I wish that animal existed. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Gotta beat these the old-fashioned way. You are out of it. Yes, I am out of it, but I'm also out of uh, walnuts. Fair, whatever they're called, fairy walnuts. Yeah, bootleg dinosaur Gary Gygax found. Awesome. Like, I wish. Right, I guess that's true. Right, we were supposed to remind you to buy walnuts ASAP. Awesome. Well, I discovered it myself. Which is, but I appreciate y'all. Is this the wrong way again? This is where I. Well, no, maybe not. Obtained one dream read. Uh, I really do not want these fellas. We should work together to defeat this threat. Don't regret this. Sahagin. Sahugin? Languages have rules, guys. I love how it's just like, how do you want to pronounce it, D&D &D people? Oh, not on my watch, Pricklebeak. I hate that they get fully healed when they do that. It's a Huagin. But that's wrong. It's just wrong. It's spelled differently. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, there's so many of these dudes. They take forever to kill. Oh, and now they're killing me. Yeah, 
Hey, Durin. You have 300% of your stuff. Use it. Uh, this literally feels like a game where I am Angela, but once in a while I possess the other guys. <laughs> like Mario Odyssey. And I hate that the NPCs aren't smart enough to, like, use the charge attack to break their shields. I gotta do everything around here. Oof. It's a hog in. That's what I was trying to do, yeah. Yay. Come on, we're almost there. Somebody's got to level up or something, right? Because I need that. I need those resources. Awesome. We don't have to be on guard for now. Cool. Uh, all right. Well, I'm doing okay. I'm gonna give a candy or two to you. I'm gonna switch back to. Angela. Right, so it's going to be some time, I, I figured. Oh. Hey. Am I crazy? It, It's H-A-U-G-I-N, right? I have to look this up. This is going to bother me forever now. Quick, uh, quick uh, detour there. It's a hogging. Has it always been Sahu again? This is a Bernstein Bears moment. Oh, man. Am I? No, wait. So, they, they're... Hold on. In FF7, it's Sahagin. That's what I'm thinking of. Okay. So, that makes sense. Where's my game now? Okay, I'm back. A lot of XP for Bill and Bet. You're going in circles, if that's what you were going to ask. Some old games like Mislocalize and Sahagin, I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, it, um... That does appear to be the case. So, I'm not going in circles. I'm, I'm getting there, I think. Oh, shit, you're totally right. All right, I'll look at the big map. Like a sucker. Um... All right, so I have to go down, around, and then up. Nope. Yay, money. Oh, cool, more bullets. Boo. <laughs> 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 I know I shouldn't face it head on, but I'm just ever the optimist. Oh yeah, totally. They like shamelessly lifted it. But I don't feel bad for D&D because they shamelessly lifted it from Tolkien and Borges, so it doesn't really And they just got it from mythology mostly. Tolkien Tol the Tolkien ones are a little bit closer to original, I would say. Of all of them. The oasis here, you can rest and buy items. Sweet. Hey, there's Arrow. That's why I haven't replied, sorry. <laughs> I was like, I'll get back to him after. Um, listen while I work. Do -do 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 -do. Um, Tolkien cribbed a lot of names from Nordic mythology. Yeah, of course. Are, are orcs even his creation? I mean, they're arguably based on the Drawker, but I don't know if um if that's true. Okay, I have to... Alright. Give me two seconds. I'm gonna go grab that book to show you guys what the hell I'm talking about.
Okay, so Jorge Luis Borges. I can't speak Spanish. I'm trying. Um, the Book of Imaginary Beings. This is a super cool read because Borges is an amazing writer, and it is like all of the things you know from playing games is it's in this book. Like, let me just read you a couple of the the names of a couple of entries in here. Right, you've got the Bahamut. Okay, that's one. The Behemoth. Yep, cool. Uh, let's see. The Katobal Pass. Yep. Um, oh, the Eloy and the Morlocks. That's fun. Um, there's a ton in here. There's a ton. Everything you've seen in D&D or Final Fantasy or uh, Dragon Quest is in here. Although, the Bullet is not. So I wonder... I could have swore I read it in here, though. I wonder if it's under a different name. Regardless, check out the book. It's really good. I... I don't get a kickback. I just think it's really good. Yeah, I actually said that on the D-pad many moons ago. Um, because I found- that blew my mind when I saw that. If, like, of course they are! They look- obviously they are! But I never put it together in my dumb brain. Anyway, that was today's book lesson. Uh, <laughs> let's go buy some shit. So, I want items. What are the Knoll's origin? I don't remember. Um, we're gonna go ahead and buy... Well, maybe not that many. Um, although I do have a lot of money, which is cool. I'll buy a solid 15. That seems good. We got equipment upgrades in the next area. Yep, hopefully 15 was the right number. We'll find out. So now I'm just not even gonna bother being here. I'm just gonna continue on. Ugh, excuse me. Make sure they're on your ring menu too. Oh, right. I do hate that. Yeah, in that moment when you realize that all the dwarves in The Hobbit are straight taken from a list of names in the Pros Etta, yeah, which also includes the name Gandalf, right, yeah, it's, um, it's awesome. So yeah, man, it all starts with Norse mythology. And even that goes further back. You can trace things, um, there's a lot of parallels actually in... You've heard of, like, the Indo-European cultures. There's a lot of parallels between Northern mythology, Germanic mythology, and uh, Indian, Hindu mythology, which is crazy to think about, but it does... You can trace it all the way back to the ancient past when those were groups who came from the same origin. Um, even things like Zeus and Jupiter and Deus Pater. I talk about this all the time. You've probably heard me say it, but... Um, they're all variations on the same, like, title that derived from a Indo-European god. Where is the walnut? How do I add it to my thingy? Um, I probably don't need the rope anymore. There we go. Jupiter is Zeus daddy. Yeah, exactly. Um, <laughs> which I love. Let's see. It was, Knowles were created by a guy named Lord Dunsany, who was very unclear what they were in his story other than evil. Oh, nice. I kind of feel that way about orcs. They're kind of vague. And they've kind of been reinvented in like the Warcraft way um, because of D&D. Oh, I probably should have like actually gone to a inn. That would have been smart. Oof. Gnome plus troll equals hyena. Hey, target. Nope, that was win, but that was for the other guy. Whatever, though. Right, let's, let's get my head back in the game. I'm too busy thinking about stories. Um, which is fun, but not helpful to me winning my stream tonight. Okay. Goblin and Kobold are also etymologically related. Yep. That makes sense. Yeah, an alternate spelling of Cobalt is um, with a C. I think it's yeah. I think it's just C O B O L D. Um, but yeah, I think they are etymologically related as well. Son of a bitch. Where is my thing that fixes this problem? Gonna give it to Angela. Now Angela is gonna use an attack that'll eviscerate this thing. 
Yeah, and kobolds as we know them is like... It's weird, in Final Fantasy they're like little dogs. I think, in like four or five maybe? Um, but in actual mythology they're kind of like... Um, goblins. But in D&D they're like little reptile creatures. So, they're just very inconsistent with all that. Oh, third edition changed that. That's why. Okay, cool. So Cobalt's did used to be dog-like. That's that's cool. I should probably heal. Although, Durin, what am I paying you for, man? Get your shit together, Durin. I'm just going all out with the candy. Whole team is gonna be sugar rush. Uh, there we go. Woof! You guys are weak to wind, right? Well, whenever you're dead. I mean. Just, just to be clear, I've killed all these enemies before, right? I think this is taking forever. He's supposed to use items too, though. I thought I, I thought we changed his um his whole deal to be use some items sometimes too. Oh no, we didn't. We we made it full. We made it so Reese would use items and Durin would use magic. Okay, I remember. This is a good time for this move. That felt good. Got to admit. Oh, come on. Clink. <laughs> Finally. Tolkien created his universe because he was bummed Catholic Christianity, did, Catholic Christianity did not have cool mythology like the Norse did. That doesn't surprise me whatsoever. That's amazing. Um, he always denies that there were any allegories in his work, though. Or he did, rather. Um... Hey, I'm going up here. I want to see what's up. I mean, it's also been said it's an allegory for, um, what? For World War One or World War Two? Um, John, I never want to see another pair of pants again. Yeah, uh, I don't blame you, man. I would, I don't know how you haven't gone nuts yet. Arrow's helping me animate some very intricate pixel art, and it is a lot. It's a lot of work. He's a hero, though. He's really good at what he does. Um, Desert Capel... Capel. Desert Capel certain. Um, guess that's where I'm going. Alright, let's do some more fighting. At least I got out of the way that time. Alright, here's what's going down. Y'all are weak to wind. So I'll keep doing that. It, actually, you're not weak to win. What were you weak to? Somebody want to nut me? Somebody want to nut me? It's not a thing you can say on stream. Uh, can somebody type that so I can screenshot it? <laughs> a thousand points to whoever types, somebody want to nut me? There you go. Perfect. Because Rick always asks me, like, what should I call your stream? And I'm always like, I don't remember. So, screenshotting's been good. Influences writing. I'm going to let these guys handle it while I catch up on chat. It's an allegory for an industry. Right, I already said it. It's ice. Somebody want to know. Taking out all the enemies nearby. Yeah, and that's true. It doesn't seem to be a one-to-one, -one, but it, it all definitely plays a role. Um, do I have any ice? There it is. That's what I'm talking about. So satisfying to watch things die. <laughs> Makes me feel bad for saying that. Somebody... Close enough. <laughs> Whereas mine was a potential title for the episode, Arrows was just a cry for help. <laughs> just kidding. Um... There were no real allegories. You want to cool? Yeah, yeah, and cool backgrounds and epic stories and heroes and yeah. 
that gets into the death of the author stuff of how intent counts and how we read and experiences work. I think that's interesting. I think that when you're talking to someone, intent matters. But when you're writing, once you're done writing it, it's out in the world and, you know, like, your intent doesn't matter as much because it stands on its own, I guess? But I don't know. I go back and forth on this. What's up? Welcome. Haven't done this in a while. Lots of wares to browse. I've got enough of everything. Come again. Yeah, just like the shopkeeper. Hey, Carnium, time to swim on our buddy. Can I link a comic? Yeah, sure. I think so. I, I, I'll take a quick. Whatever. I'm. The stream's already off the rails, so I'll take a quick look here. Um. Got a, let's see, there we go. If I switch to my browser, Twitch, I can do this. Tolkien versus Lewis Allegra. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, that comic is perfect, actually. Um, they are an interesting bunch to me because they had that, I forget what they called it. They had some silly name for it, but they had that like group of writers. It was like C.S. Lewis and Tolkien and some other less famous dudes probably, um, and they would get together at a pub and talk about their writing ideas. And I thought that was so cool. Um, I want to have that, you know, like bounce ideas off people, yada yada. What you got for me, Durin? Got any good news? I think it's a good thing, the whole death of the author idea. Like, for example, November Rain by Guns N' Roses is one of my favorite songs. But Axl Rose is, by all accounts, a terrible person, right? But thankfully, he released the song 20 years ago, and the song is a thing separate from him. And I can enjoy the song even knowing he's a terrible person. Yeah, I should go to the end, right? Um, and there's tons of examples of similar things like that. Harry Potter comes to mind right now. Um, so, let's find the end. There it is. Okay. Probably drop off some seeds, too, but not the gold ones. Really scared I'm gonna mess that up. Item C. Yes. Absolutely, yeah. Um, it gets more complicated and the terrible person still gets money from their work and uses it for terrible things. I mean, that's a good point too, yeah. What about Lovecraft? Oh, don't ruin Lovecraft for me, please. <laughs> Was he a bad dude? I feel like anyone from over 50 years ago was probably a bad dude. Yep, there it is. Ah, bummer. But then again, so was everyone in America. So, I don't even know what to think anymore. Everybody sucks. Was, no, that can't be true. Come on. Oh, that's so bad if that's Welcome. true. I'm so sorry. Everyone. Um, I'm going to rest until morning. That is really bad. If that, if true. Bad if true. Uh, <laughs> I love the shots of them sleeping, and the gentle snoring. Uh. So I wonder, like, obviously that is a very racist name for a cat, and that's not okay. Do not endorse or agree with any of that. Was he actually racist in terms of like how he conducted himself and what he said and did to people or you know was it like a part of the times joking about it which is still not cool I'm saying not cool but I just want to understand like were they hateful or were they just ignorant not that it's really bad both are bad but it's just not cool yeah uh, totally agree. South of the Desert, always on fire. Yeah. So, uh, thank you for that very wonderful enlightening update, NPC. I think you're right, Oxbury. I think you're you're totally right here. It's not cool at all, and let's just keep on walking. Ooh, racist for his time. That sounds even worse. All right. So yeah, we'll 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 leave that be and move on. Um, if it isn't abundantly clear, racism is bad. I just want to point that out for anyone who might have been on the fence. It's real bad. More in 2020 than you would think, especially. We have to be very careful about what we say and what we do. And 
it's just the world's a sad dark place. Racism bad. <laughs> bad. Now for some jaunty music while I'm riding a fucking ninja turtle. Which is much better. <laughs> now then, Buscav, take us to Dusk Moon Forest. Dusk Moon Forest. Oh crap. So be prepared. Overly sarcastic on love sign. Oh yeah, totally, yeah. Discrimination is bad. Obviously racism, sexism, ageism. I mean they're all bad. Discrimination bad. Maybe that's all we need to say for the title of the episode. Discrimination bad. Where's the... That's probably not the best part, place to dock. Carnium, I can't look at your link right now, but what's it a link to? Oh, hello. There was a sub? Did it pop up on the... Uh... Oh, maybe my widget's broken, but thank you for subbing. <laughs> Golden Road. Yay! All right, cool. Moonlight Town Mintus. Yeah. Let's just take a quick peek. Who subbed? Sancho the Mighty. Oh, hey! Hey, Sanchez. Um. They them. Uh, right. Oh, my Envy, I missed the first part of your message, so all I saw was like, doot, 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 are Nazis and pedophiles? Like, it was a question, and I loved it. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's all bad. Hey, free shit. Money. Is R? R is. Okay, let's, let's, let's move this game forward now, huh? Moonlight Town Mintas. Hooray for new content, right? Are their ears we're even we're pointier we're than everyone else's? Here, but they aren't doing any harm. The townsfolk seem friendly at least. Okay. So not all beastmen are fighters like those earlier invaders. Racism! We there we go! We're learning! Hooray! <laughs> the the SE hero. <laughs> Out of context. All that racism was making me thirsty. <laughs> That's terrible. That's. You, oh, can't say things like that. No, just kidding. Sorry. Um, let's talk to this guy. Is it nighttime? It must be morning, I think. Ooh, you're not in touch. You are not well. I'm gonna not go in anywhere yet, because I want to explore. If I were this game, I would have put a cactus in this area. I wonder if that's going to be a thing. There should be a special font effect that's not quite italic for innuendo. That's a good point. It would, you know, we have bold and italic. We have underline, which isn't quite right. Strike through, which isn't quite right. Like wiggly text? Yeah, I guess wiggly text would probably be the best one. I'm actually building a system like that for a game right now. Um, similar to like what Animal Crossing does. Can anyone uh, confirm that Cactus is here? I just I feel like he must be. I mean, I'm finding a bunch of stuff. Wow, that's a lot of money. Uh, I'm finding a bunch of stuff, so it's still worth it. But there must be one, yes. Okay, cool. Hooray for ceaseless destruction. Needless destruction. And ceaseless destruction. All of us in the town are beast folk, but we ba -ba -doo, doo doo Okay, so the king and his soldiers are the ones who are hungry for man flesh, if you will, but the average beast folk is decent folk. That's good. Cactus is in every town from here on. Oh, sweet. Glossing over the lore, I see. Was I? No, he said that, um... You know, the king and his men were the ones fighting humans, but he was good. 
What else? Did I miss another lore thing? <laughs> sure, I'll, I'll put that in the title contender thing. Um, Ferulia lies to the west of Duskmoon Forest. The king hates humans. Oh, lost my thing. Uh, so much that he sent his best guards to attack Wendell. I'm glad it failed. Yeah, see, these are good, good people. Hey, hey, who's this little guy? Who's this little fella right here? Time needed to escape from battle will be halved. That's exciting, I guess. Um, four more times till I can run away like a baby. Just the bappity boo. Duskmoon Forest is home. Oh, I see what you mean. Uh, Ferolia, the coin hostile leave is a tread lightly. So this is probably where I came in. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's go to some shops. I'm gonna buy some stuff if I can afford it. Uh, thanks for giving me honest about the titles, guys. That's uh, always useful. All right, what do you got? You're taking your kid to a weapon shop. This is good. Can't talk to him though. I can club him, but I cannot talk to him. Welcome. Oh, cause there weren't that many treasure chests before, or you mean the design? Lots of wares to browse. Okay, equipped. Ooh, Istok. That's from Symphony of the Night. I'm sure it's actually a real sword in real life, but um. Whoa. Wait. Did I miss some from these guys? All right, sweet. Shrewd Good staff choice. it is. I'll make use of this. Oh, these are Good way. Choice. There are two different kinds of weapons here. Uh-oh. Is there a catch? Oh, am I going to regret it? <laughs> There's no catch. Oh, but you're pointing it out because it's important. It's an important detail. Hmm. Oh, good choice. Well, I'm still gonna keep buying the best one. This is useful. Oh, it's great to have money. So it sounds like there's probably a reason for there being two here. I did notice that and thought it was a little weird, but I was like, oh, maybe because I missed some before. But no, you're right. That wouldn't matter. Um. Let's get some armor Again. too. Every class has their own equipment. The other pieces of equipment are for the basic normal classes. Oh, Welcome. cool, 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 cool. I get it. Lots of wares to browse. Got it. Okay. That's good to know. Oh, good choice. This is good quality. It's a modest bump right there. I don't know. If that's worth it. All right. I love shopping, and I love you, Angela. I had wanted this. Manny plate. All right, let's sell the armor we no longer need. Oh, Garnium. I <laughs> somehow Manny plate doesn't sound as bad as Petty boots. Gotta say. Um, get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. <laughs> Come again. All right. So now we are souped up. That was a big increase in terms of equipment power, so that's exciting. Um, I don't really need to sleep. I can just check out some of these other houses and see if I miss anything. Excuse me. Um, actually, you guys should let me know if I'm in danger of missing anything important, because I do want to move things forward because we started a little late, and I don't know how long I can go today. Um, ooh, ran off to join the king. So quick to take up arms, yeah. Daddy's terrible! Cool. Sorry, kid. How do you mean, SD Hero? Just like... Like, could I have missed something or whatever? Or? Oh, if you refuse to change classes. Right, yeah, that would be weird, though. I guess there's not that much here anyway, so... What up, old man? I'm in your house! Man, they went through all the effort to put stairs and a door there, but... 
for no reason, apparently. I see what you're saying. SD hero. Alright, let's move it forward. Another weird thing is how the game says multiple times you should have changed class by now when in the remake you could have done it a long time ago. You guys just changed a little bit Oh. That's interesting. I love reverse engineering things like that, yeah. I read this great article on, like, the history of Chrono Trigger Day, and it was interesting to hear about the design process. Just, like, there actually aren't a lot of time paradoxes that happen. And they were like, yeah, we, we thought about it, but it would have sucked. It wouldn't have been fun. So we didn't do it. And I was like, yeah, yeah, that does make sense. You know, like, so, like, no butterfly effect kind of thing really goes on, except for the first one. I won't spoil it. Yep. And how it would have been... But they actually filled a 32... They were the first 32 meg Super Nintendo game. And they filled every ounce of it. According we to the team. We can find the Moonstone in this forest for sure. I'm finally gonna get some payback for what those beastmen did. I'll scratch my head angrily. I will pose with my cool wing helmet. And I'm Angela. Okay. Let's press on. I feel like this is a trap. <laughs> this area's map is pretty unintuitive, so you can't quite trust the star. I would play a super game. That would be awesome. Um, just picturing, like, Chrono Trigger, Secret of Mana, and Final Fantasy VI somehow merged in a horrible pastiche of epicness. I would love it. All right, let's see what you guys... Are like. Um, so if I do the magic thing, it should tell me. Didn't you guys say it would tell me who was weak to it? Yeah, I figured that was probably the worst call. That's why I'm looking at all this right now. I thought you guys said there was an easy way to, like, tell what the weaknesses were. Did I make that up? Puppy's no weakness. Oh, I... Ch that used to be... <laughs> okay, so that used to be my button for holy, so I'll have to reset it. Um, whoopsie. Let me do that now. Where's... Holy Bolt. Cool. Yeah, it's called Praying for the Best. <laughs> Can't see the add-on risk of square in particular. Yes, that is true. Um, you select the spell and then hover over the enemy. Oh, because it lets you choose when you select. I've never actually done that in battle. Okay, that's why I was confused. Um, that we makes more sense. must get to the stone before someone activates it. Like every game. Hey, who's out of there? Oh, let's see. So he's... I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to be able to do that, but... I did it! <laughs> um... I don't know. I Stubbornness? I just feel like this game has more platforming elements than it should for a non-platformer. So there's gotta be ways to exploit it. So, <laughs> I don't know. It just felt good. So... I'm wondering if I can, like, skip to a different part. Like, am I also not supposed to be here yet? Whoa. Candy. Well, it wasn't entirely worth it. Clubbed. That's good, then. I, I was worried I was actually sequence-breaking in a non-good way, so... Oh, those sounds make me sad. I feel like I'm beating a puppy, which is not a good thing at all. Uh, okay, cool. And yeah, that's where I was. So let's keep on keeping on. Speed run probably wouldn't care about little cactus anyway. Yeah, but we're definitely... Not, I don't know what we're doing here, but it's definitely not a speed run. <laughs> is this a thing? This looks important. Looks nice, at least. Um, you are for sure beating a puppy. Awesome. <laughs> I'm going straight to hell. Oh, terrifying clown ghost. 
Awesome. Even better. Can't wait to meet him. Two chocolates. Uh, can I go? No. Why would I be able to? Okay. Let's go this way. Oh, a lot of clown ghosts. And some treasure. Ooh, the puppy grew up. Okay, so let's see if I can like learn something here. So it's weak to that. You're not weak. So I'll do that. Wow, selecting magic is great. <laughs> That's highly useful. Let's... Yep, so no weakness there on those guys, so that's fine. Um, but I will continue just holy bolting you and hope it gets you pretty quick. There we go, healing light. He just looks like the Kevin character when he's in beast form, right? Oh, right, it's AoE. Yeah, that's a good idea. Good point. I kind of forgot that that one upgraded. All right, we got to level up. Finally, let's do something with that. So, you. I mean, you're so close to being maxed out, I'm just going to keep doing it. And then, what do I want for you? I don't know. This is a tough one. Um, I'll, just, I'll just do this. Sure. Okay. What's it going to be? Two cups of wishes. Ah, ah, ah. One silver item seed. Ah, ah, ah. Kenda. I'm going to keep talking like this for the rest of the night. Just kidding. That would be miserable. Um, working on spirit is good for eventual AoE debuffs in the next class. Maybe. Yeah, I still haven't decided what I want to do. I'll just wing it <laughs> when the time comes. These classes have been good, though. I don't really have any complaints, except... I don't know. I haven't played enough as the other two to really have a strong opinion, which is on me, but I'm just really enjoying Angela. I don't know. Can I walk in the water? Yeah, okay, okay, cool. I don't have literally how I feel. What one's the ice? Are you the ice? There we go. Oh, yeah, that's great. It's not the weakness, but it hits everybody. It's so good. They're creepy that they're clown ghosts. Clowns are fine, ghosts are fine. Clown ghosts, I'm not cool with. Yes. We must get to the stone before someone activates it. Always talk about points and There's anything you really want to Oh, so like build them up, but not spend them and wait and see okay. I know what to do. Alright. Willikers. These guys are not as tough as I thought they would be. Does that say Wolfmon? <laughs> Come on, that's silly. Wolfmon. I'm Wolfmon. Victory is easy with reliable companion. Victory is a reliable companion. Alright, so... Yaman, yeah. Alright, uh... I'm tempted to go down this way just because I... It's probably just loops back to where I was, but I know I'm going the wrong way. I'm just checking it out. More dudes to kill. I don't know. I guess I'm just going to go back toward the star. There's a lot of optional forest. Okay, great. Um, then I will ignore it. Maybe I'll find it on the way back. Hey, one of those statues there. I know what this. I know how this works. I'm going to do that. Save the game. Oh, I'm excited. <laughs> it eventually leads to Beast Kingdom Ferolia in that direction, but you can't do anything there ever. Ever? Is that true? Is it like only for a different playthrough, or is it just like an unfinished thing, or or are you trolling me, or all potential options? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, I guess this is it, folks. I'm going in! A 
Sometimes I just make faces into the camera. Well, yeah, don't worry, we're going to find out which one by voting on your phone. <laughs> Great. Yeah, a lot of good music. This whole game has had solid music, actually. I didn't really know what to expect. Ooh, spooky. Spooky! Chart Moon Tower. Is this where they chart the moon? Oh, cool. I imagine that's not an ally. In fact, I think I can see who it is. I saw that moon chart on the roof there. Hmm. Here's how I know I'm in trouble. Because that's an enemy, and it's surrounded by blue jars. So, I'm starting to think... Uh-oh. <laughs> you had no chance of defeating Lutgar. <laughs> oh, that was satisfying. <sighs> He's a nightmare. Oh, with those pesky Altanans. I'll take care of this mess. He's got the face of Look Emerald that. Weapon or whatever. Do um palace. Yikes. There's three starting areas that only get used in their respective yum, campaigns. Okay, that makes yum. sense. What a veritable feast of souls for me today. <laughs> ah, Gourmand, right. Whoa! Okay, that's the first, like, confirmed, definite murder. That, she's not coming back. But I suppose I must send one off to the masked mage. The masked mage. I love Cell. Our Was Cell like the old name? Or? Low, after all. We need many more souls. Hey, Radar. <laughs> Why, thank you. I appreciate that. I was actually late today because of Rick. Of um, but yeah. More souls if we want to do the forbidden magic to open up the portal. Okay. Let my master know that I'm taking my own share of the spoils. Yeah, Gourmand actually seems to work here. Hey, it's this guy. Oh, Never noticed his pom pom on his head, though. Oh, he's a prince. Home so soon? Lies! You lied! Said I could bring Carl back to life! Is that really his voice? <laughs> Fool! You are the one who fell for the falsehood! Such an innocent soul. Oh, dodged a bullet there, huh? You must taste lies. You lie. I can't even get my voice that high. Lies, you lies. Oh, I'm so glad I <laughs> turned that wolf pup Carl against you. A knight's character from Bizarro World. Fair. Oh, ho, ho, ho. interesting. Why don't you just devour his soul? I think you'll be my midnight snack. No, Carl! Carl. Just like your friend Carl. <laughs> ha. Finish you off in one gulp. Man who eats death. Stop right there. I mean, we get death eaters from Harry oh, Potter. It no sounds kind of cool. I can see how that might sound cool in Japanese. Was it like... Wait. Hito no Tabe no Hito? Beast man, traitor Kevin in the forest. He's a half beast man. I am not oh. letting him get away from me. Shio Kurao Toko. Oh wow, First, literally man. I'll get rid of this Interesting. filth. You can help me warm up for the main events. Kevin and Charlotte share a story. No, then unsubscribe instantly. I <laughs> don't. No, thank you. Beast mode. Literally. Oh, Mamma Mia. Well, I'm glad I'm fighting this guy because I don't think Death Death Gourmand Man seemed pretty bad. I'm just gonna go ahead and get those numbers up. Hi. Let's try this. Pommel Star! So good. 
All right, and let's do some magic. Not weak to holy. Not weak to wind, it looks like. Not weak to dark. I just don't think he's weak. So in that case, what's my best move? I will use Dark Force. That's exactly what Oxford said, huh? All right, well, it took me a minute, but I got there. Hey, do your thing, uh, thank you. Okay, I can't complain. He did pretty quick that time. Let's... Triple Slash! Whoop. Yikes. Here, let me... Switch to her so that hopefully... Uh, Alright, I'll just use Cup of Wishes. It's faster anyway. He doesn't have a weakness at all. I'm fairly sure he's going to be plus another wood spell. Okay, cool. And then... Nope. You're the one. Hey. Oh, wrong button. Oh, I undid... I unequipped dark... Whatever. Okay. So I'll do it the old-fashioned way. Jack Fosh. It's a pretty sweet spell. I know I'm plowing through MP, but I love it. Let's go ahead and eat some walnuts. God, I, I'm s I need to unequip the gold item seed. I'm just scared to... It looks like a walnut, so I keep going for it. Let's go ahead and then dock force again. Nothing is weak to wood? That's annoying. Why'd they bother then making them... Did they just run out of time to do it right? Or... You know what's interesting? Like... Every freaking RPG has elements of some kind. And they're, like, how can we put a spin on that to make it feel more unique? Like, I like the elements in a game. Like, I think it feels nice, but, like, water's strong against fire. Like, yeah, of course. And, like, so this added wood and moon, which are weird and interesting, and apparently they didn't even do a good job of using them. But, like, I want to have an element system that's, like, a little more... Interesting. Pokemon kind of did it with like types and dual types, but still, at the end of the day, water beats fire. You know. Look, man, I'm mostly used to secret. I actually have a. That's so funny you said that. I actually have a document writing that up. I was um. I I work on the side for a startup that does uh, kind of like educational games and uh, using the chemistry elements as elements was an idea for one that's kind of like a fun educational game. Um, let's see. Where is... I'm here to use Couple Wishes. That's what I'm trying to do. Here. I will never Weirder elements like Spider or Boomerang. <laughs> okay, that's kind of odd. I've seen that somewhere, I think. Um... Oh, and a walnut, huh? All right. Time to nut. Don't hit me, bro. Oof. Oh, that was a rough one. Let's see. That would have been good advice, but... Oh, 
Oh, totally. Yeah. Well, I think the dual types thing is is actually the most interesting Pokemon, the most interesting thing Pokemon brings to JRPGs. But like, it wouldn't be fun if you had like three types. You can't like, in, you can't iterate on it that way. Um, but I don't want no types, and so I, I want it to be more, maybe more like it doesn't just determine damage. You also have like resonances, or maybe like attack is related to your fire score and. Defense is related to your water or earth score or something, but like I, I don't know. I'm just looking for ways to make it feel a little less stale. I like it. I don't want to not have an element system. I think that is like born a part of it. Especially trained in hand-to-hand combat by the king himself since you were young. Time for a strange scene, apparently. Look, I wanted the king to teach me what he taught you so badly. Did he teach you badly, or did I you want it badly? You and your good fortune. In the end, I was just another beast guard. Nothing. Trials more. of Man A. No matter how hard I wished. Mm. Mm. But you, you hated fighting. All that talent wasted. I, I couldn't forgive that. You had. Everything I wanted, and you didn't even care. I wasn't gonna lose to such a worthless prince. And yet, and yet you lost to some unrelated Luka, people near him. You are strong. Strong oh, enough. Oh shit! To be I almost just unplugged the entire rig Same here. That would have sucked. Whoops. <laughs> Thanks, Kevin. Just keep. Getting stronger. Maybe in my next life, I'll be able to defeat you. <laughs> Don't you dare lose before then. Oh, yeah, that's cool, Arrow. That I've seen stuff like that too. That does make sense. And in like in Mario RPG, like jump is actually an element, sort of, you know. Luna. Um, the of the moon. Oh, right? it's Luna! We did it. That was easy. I thought we were gonna have to like go into the castle yes. and shit, but nope. I've been waiting for your arrival. I will grant you my power. I'm not. I'm gonna go ahead and say it. I don't love this design. There's Please, a number of help. potential issues with that design. I'm afraid, I'm afraid I can't. Can He's a dick. Wish. Nobody in my party can ever use moon magic? Whoops. That sucks. The fuck? <laughs> You're you totally right, Oxford. That's a weird scene. Give him another chance in his next life. He will now be he really babby. Yeah. <laughs> right. It's so silly. What? <laughs> what? Baby is Ludger? And you're yeah. the father, Kevin. He will grow big and strong and one day come to challenge you again. Okay. Well, that's like not even good. Baby Ludger. Challenge I'll me right now. <laughs> challenge me anytime. That was definitely a weird scene. <laughs> he... He needs help. Um, <laughs> is he going to be okay in the forest all alone? He's just a baby. Yes, very astute fairy. Babies are raised in the wild. The forest sure. creatures take Bye -bye, care of them until they are grown. I'll add that to the mix. Don't worry. He is safe. It is the Beast Man way. Beast Men sound like Incredible. not my favorite race to be born Luna? into. I don't think I would make it out of the forest the as a baby. Is on the first Just floor saying. Of this tower. And Luna's design really bums me out. Activate its power, but Ludger and his guards managed to protect it. Either be the weird plant it's thing with the ring, or be a human face. 
but they don't mix well here. The four is in the tower now. We should go after him. Oh, Just damn it. Case. So there is a tower part of this. I will stay nearby in the forest. Keep other beastmen away from here. Good, Good luck. Yeah, don't be too helpful now. Just a little helpful. Oh, it's cuter in that drawing, actually. Because the head is less squished and she's got little plant hands. That makes more sense. Um, now that you can access Luna's powers, you can use moon ele elemental magic by putting training points toward abilities. Here are some examples. But none of my classes are going to be able to get any of those things. Is that what you were saying, Alex Britt? <laughs> I'm not mad. I just want to talk. <laughs> Alex Britt, er, era. Um... Uh, chase after Gourmand. Maybe Dern's Dark Class could learn Moon Saber eventually. No moon for you. Do I walk back and save? Yeah, of course I do. What time is it even? Uh, oh yeah, we got some time still. We got some time. Gonna walk on to a safe point. Gonna make sure my shit don't die. Gonna wait for the load screen. It's gonna take a bit of time. Still waiting for the load screen, but it's pretty much just about done. Gonna go on toward the healing, saving statue. Like we've always done. I don't know. I think I rhymed done with done, so no credit for that. But I'm going to save the game and then continue on. Most of the moon magic is for Kevin and Hawkeye. Oh, okay, yeah, so I'm just really, like, not not made for moon magic here. That's okay. Is it good? You said, Didn't you say it's got no attack magic anyway, other than maybe moon saber? Angela's mother and the absolute ruler of Altena Kingdom of Magicians. She is a jerk. An Isak is a pointy sword without a sharpened edge, like a long skewer. Okay, cool. Hmm. Huh. Literally forgot I was even Reese. Wait a second, can I just walk out and walk back in and farm those blue things? I, I, won't, I won't keep doing it, I'm just curious if that actually works. That's kind of fun. Is it weird that I'm at such a Dutch angle today? I really gotta fix this camera, but every time I try to move it, everything breaks, so I'm hesitant to do that. And actually, if I stand up straight, I'm mostly straight. But if I do this, it feels more correct. Even though it's weird. I don't know. Don't keep me waiting. Don't keep me waiting. Back in the original game, the moon spell that reduced max HP was a killer for bosses. Yeah, oh wow, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sword of mana. It's a form of the golden wand? What? That was a new one to me. Wow, yeah, you can totally just farm those blue dudes. That's good to know. So my camera setup is... It is what it is because I have a big-ass monitor, and I'm on Zoom calls all day. So I have it mounted on the top of my monitor, but it's really precarious because it's a real... DSLR photography camera and I don't have a good way to keep it safely mounted on the monitor so whenever I try and move it it like falls down or whatever um, so but it, you know I was trying to get a better spot and it just kind of made it worse I think some fun buffs that actually matter in a game where criticals are actually a thing so not here really <laughs> hey a crystal mamma mia Oh, okay. It's so strange to see the moonstone just sitting here in the middle of a tower. Oh. I'm pretty sure this stone is the reason why it's always night in the surrounding forest. Well, that would make some sense. 
Hmm. These mana stones are so freaky. Hey, wasn't Gorman or whatever in here? I don't see him. These mana stones are so freaky. That man was pure evil. No shit. Felt it. He devoured the souls of a right couple of women right in front of he us. Must have left. I would be able to tell if he was still nearby. Hmm. I guess that guy is also after the Sword of Mana, just like my mother and that horrible invader Belladonna. We definitely aren't the only ones looking for it. That is true. We can't let them have it. We've come so far. Let's find that last elemental. Come on! Hmm. We still have to look for Dryad, the wood elemental. The hero king suggested we ask the elfin elder. So, we should go to the hidden elf We've been there, right? Dior. It's in Lamp Bloom Woods. Three factions. Okay, cool. Um So I'm not level enough to not high level. There was a cactus. <laughs> um I'm not high level enough to change classes then. Oh, I haven't. Okay. Good to know. Um, we haven't been to land. Why have I heard the names before? I don't know. I guess it was just mentioned. I'm surprised that doesn't happen more often. Okay, so it's not worth talking to this because it's going to be like, who should change classes? And I'm going to be like, can't do it. Also, apparently, I can't talk to things at all. Who is switching classes? Nope. 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 Oh, you want to wait? That's okay. That's okay. Fairy's very gentle. You want to wait? That's okay. Alright, let's go find Dryad. What's going to happen when we assemble all the Elemental Avengers? Probably the Benevidons are going to be unleashed somehow. Then we'll have to kill them. Oh, I didn't even see any doors. They're all locked anyway, but now I want to see. I just kind of thought it was... Oh, they kind of like look locked. <laughs> and I'm just going to believe you that they are locked. Since that was my first instinct anyway. Anyway. Yeah! I am thinking of the dumb tiny people village. They're not the elves, that's different. Okay, got it. Spooky. I'll just check and make sure everything's okay. Sweet. Okay, cool. So now I have to go out of these woods. I refuse to learn their name because they are awful. Fair enough. Willikers. Um, well, everyone's at 300%, so I'm just going to have some fun with this. No, the other one. Damn it. Not the one I already weakened significantly. Ugh. Wolf Mons. I am dead. Allow me. This is how it is done in Lorup Wayne. I will not hold back. You can hear me mashing the button over here. Okay. The area is clear of threats. Cool. We have earned a rest. Let's go ahead and Come on. Come, Angela, and give her a lot of candy. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> she sounds like a talk show host. Do you want some candy? Here we go. This is how it's done in wind. Yeah. <laughs> I do love stuff like that. Happens a lot in this game, actually. I'm 
surprised the battle sound clips interrupt each other in the way they do. Like I would have thought it would be slightly different. All right. She felt his wolf-like head crush under the weight of her cane. All right. <laughs> R.I.P. to Trials of Mana. But I'm different. Wait, what do you mean? What do you mean? I'm gonna just not bother that Corgi and his men. Or maybe I am. Let us work together to the enemy. Die, monster! So the ones in purple clothes are weak to holy, and the ones not aren't. Neat. Good to know. All right, got me some some item. Let us work together to defenseless. Going and running and doing stuff, trying to get out of this dumb forest. I killed all the enemies once already, but I'm killing them all again. Maybe I can walk around these guys and not have to get in a fight. <laughs> I just, I'm hoping to get Dryad before the end of the stream, so I'm kind of trying to hurry a little bit. I won't skip all the fights, but maybe one or two. Oh yeah, you can't ford the river the old-fashioned way. Let us work together. All to right, well here we go. <laughs> I hate that sound. It feels too real. <laughs> and so the game unleashed that sound 20 more times. Although I would like to get to another class change as soon as possible, but I mean, there's zero chance of that happening tonight, but the more I fight, the sooner it comes. But really, it seems like you get so little from the average, like, group of mooks that it really is just like, you get a level or two every boss and that's about it. But the longer you wait, the more XP the enemies will give. Wait, what do you mean? Is that true? Yeah, ba da ba dum boom ba dum ba dum Oh, that's all you mean. Yeah, yeah, totally. I thought you meant, like, if I avoid doing a class change, enemies, like, progress differently. I don't know. I was half thinking and overthinking all at the same time. Sure, I'll bop to the inn. Let's do that. Where's the inn? You're the inn. No. Can't read basic maps. Do 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 do. What you want? So I just missed the door. I get it. I'm getting tired. All right. Welcome. Resting up. <laughs> Save. All right. Later. Ah, Doris, John's one weakness. But the map said it's here and I'm here and I can't go in. How can this be? <laughs> All right, let's get the hell out of here and go find some elves, I guess. It's elfin time. Don't even get me started on locked doors. No oh, wait. Hey, Buskov. A lot of flair on that. Duh, hi guys! Allow me to give you a lift across the channel. Listen to this chill jam while I do so. Search for little cactus on your journey. The more you find him, the better prizes you'll receive. We're on the last mana stone. We just have to find the wood stone. Let's go to Lamp Bloom Woods. 
Dryad is on our side, we've got all eight elementals. Then Gotta catch them all. Get the sword of mana. And become the strongest sword. <laughs> I probably should have let that play out. Sorry, I kind of wasn't thinking. Um, I doubt it would have been terribly consequential, but the strongest sword. <laughs> what will it be? <laughs> what kind of sword will it be? The strongest sword. Oh, well. Yeah. I'm trying to move quickly without rushing, which is obviously difficult. Caterpies. The strongest swo. Yeah, maybe. Let me just go ahead and get a quick yawn out of the way. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, I had a very busy weekend, so apologies for the slight sleepiness I may or may not be experiencing currently. I just realized I'm going to be sad in a minute. Ah, flip. Can't wait to find out why. It's probably going to be like, you can't play as Angela anymore. Class. <laughs> Plants are dusk moon. dusk moon vine. My powers can unseal the path. Okay. Less talking, more doing it. A new path appeared. Allow me. Don't keep me waiting. I'm still gonna be Angela. Don't. <laughs> Hello! So I can help my grandpa. She is kind of cute, but it's still like. After you hot with Wait, who's Dio? I made it through countless hardships. And finally we reached these woods. You're right. Right, right. Sorry about that. I liked it better when it was Dio. As long as yourself. It wasn't an easy trip, you know. Especially the cannon part. Yeah, oh my so goodness. So you just took a boat to Maya and asked Von Voyage for a ride in his cannon? Uh, I guess. Basic Basic-o-wee. But forget about that. Um, what are you all hanging around here for? Is there a party configuration I could choose to get we even less Charlotte? <laughs> the Elfin village of Dior. Ha ha, you'll probably never find it. After all. You don't know the secret twit, my grandma. Charlotte's actually really cute. To I just wish you. they'd Wait, just toned it down a couple secret? notches with the baby talk. Ha ha! I'm not telling! So it seems that Charlotte is an integral part of this piece of the plot. I'll take my anger out on these little, little dudes. I feel like they're not even worth using magic on them. Um, I'm sure it is probably a legitimate speech impediment. Um, yeah, exactly, yeah. I still think they could have maybe cooled it a little bit. Yeah, like Arrow said. I'm not mad at the voice director. I just want to talk to him. I'm going to have to kill all these things, aren't I? All right. Clear your way. Leave to me. Wait, do I know any fire spells? I just realized I don't, right? I've boosted the shit out of Angela's strength, haven't I? Alright, somebody needs to die here.
And it was me. Whoops. <laughs> Let's just take a quick look. First things first, I'm going to eat a chocolate. Yep. I was just going to say, I probably have some points here. Oh, I'm actually literally one away from learning Fireball. So that might be good. And then that spirit skill. Cool. Nice. So, all right, let's figure out what I want to switch out. Increase magic attack by 5% in battle. I like that. 15% chance the enemy met. I could probably lose that one, I guess. Magic damage dealt increases by 5. Yep. Yep. So I need this to be victory MP boost. Wow, am I actually, like, understanding the way this game works? Good God. Okay. What about the other guys? I went right to Angela, but you've got some, too. Sure. Doesn't hurt. And you've still got one left. I guess I'm heading towards stamina. Okay, and what, what, what do we have here? Defense, increased defense, 20%, eh, meh. Stat down MP saver, oh, okay. That's fine, right? Yeah, fuck it. Cool. That seems like it could be good. 5% to CS gauge after winning battle. Attack increased by the enemy. Okay, victory CS boost. Add 5% to CS gauge when enemy defeated. And then stat down MP saver. That's probably really good for her. Let's try that. Okay. Hopefully I did all that reasonably competently. We'll find out. the way I came from? <laughs> yeah, I think it is. Oh, I was doing so well. I was like, oh, look at me. Doing things right. Knowing what I'm doing. And then immediately starts running backwards. There we go. Let's murder. Careful. I want to try a fireball. Well, nobody's weak to it, but I don't know. Do you guys have any weaknesses? Let's see. Um, nope. Whatever, I'll just do this because it's a group attack. Is this only stream seven? It feels like so much longer in some ways. Oh, man. oh, what's all that over there? Hmm, these are big flowers. Oh! Did you do the job? Oh, I gotta fight him? Like, oh, like, can I just run away? <laughs> okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. That was a. Grumpy bug. And I'm gone. Let's see. Mm, I'm gonna cop a wishes for Angela. Wake up, girlfriend. This is like almost a serious battle. Dribbles there! Oh, that would have been so nice. Wow. It's bonkers. Oh, so they're kind of like glass cannons. But they go down pretty easily. Get ready! Yeah, I definitely... MP management is the 
only really challenging part of this game. Arguably, it's not even really challenging. Alone. It's the only thing that like once in a while right. catches you. The secret is the flowers. I'm sorry, the what? Night, some flowers grow e excuse red. me? Follow those. So get based on this, the flowers get married at night? Is that Look, correct? See the red flowers? That's the way to Dior. <sighs> <sighs> I don't want to deal with monsters, so you all do it. Risk your lives. I mean, she is a literal child, so that's fair. Um, I'm just going to keep going this way because it's clearly the right way. Maybe I'll do some quick... Oh, I can just cast Healing Light whenever, huh? That's exciting. Healing light. Obviously, it's probably smarter to use Heal. items, but it's kind of fun. Got you covered. For a bro, like, I kind of like Duran. You know, he's like, he's a bro. Wet flowers are the way to Dio. <laughs> what didn't you get about that, right? Um, yeah, that's a, another potential title. <laughs> My brain is loading time today. Okay. Why are those ones wet? They must be the way to Dio. What's up, nobody? Welcome to the stream. I'm thinking about Dio. <laughs> Pick it up. Pick, Pick it up. <laughs> I hear you, brave young Jables. You are hungry for the <laughs> Oh my god. Dio from JoJo or Dio from the D-pad? Dio from Rainbow! Dio the 70s rock star who's like the best rock singer of all time, literally. Um, this is the wrong way, because it's not wed. Allow me. Don't keep me waiting. Eat a walnut. <laughs> Here we go. Well, that's a little bit of red, but that's a lot of red and also has a save point. So I'm going this way. What about that treasure chest? Oh shit, I didn't even see one. Um, the Dio that the JoJo Dio is named after. Is that right? Oh, that's cool. I did not see a single chest. Oh, the one right here in front of me? Obtained one honey elixir. So I don't know anything about JoJo, actually. My shame. No Joey JoJo Jr. Shabadoo. That's a good one. Everyone, everything in JoJo's name for a musician band or song. Oh, awesome. Yeah, Ronnie James Dio and Marlon Brando. Oh, that's awesome. I probably do know, yeah, you're right. I probably know something about JoJo just through osmosis. I'm going to do a double save because this has been a good stream. Right, let's carry on. Oh man, those lady bees are hard. They're not hard, but they do a lot of damage. So I'm gonna eat another candy. And I'm gonna be smart, and I'm gonna try and suss out their weakness. Well, it's not ice, and it's not light, and it's not wind, and it's not darkness, and it's not fire, and it's not earth. So it's ice. <laughs> That's what we're going to say. Anything that doesn't have a weakness is ice. Don't get me out of there, no! Nice that you'll be finally returning to the East Coast. I will! I'm very excited. So, so excited. A weakness to darkness. <laughs> oh no. I'm pretty sure I've always had that. I'm just going to indiscriminately ice smash until everyone around me is dead. Oh, I guess that's true. I just feel like I've been having decent luck with ice smash, so I keep reaching for it, but you're right. Can you die? 
Can do everything? Jeebus. Hmm. Do I have to actually do this the right way and go up there like a real person, or can I find a cheap, stupid way? So while you're back here, you need to try Casey's Burger Bar and Fork and Sandwich? Wait, what? Are those real places? <laughs> Took too long and the wet is gone? Is that a real thing? Did I fuck up? Where are you located again? Nobody? You're in Rhode Island, right? Did I make that up? Somebody's in Rhode Island. I, I could do it the right way, but I like doing it the sketchy, shitty way that I've been doing. Where I just get lucky and don't have to do anything right. Oh, it has to be night. Okay, that's what's going on. So follow the star, but then... Make it night. Alright, so now, Pokemon rules? Is anybody weak to fire here? No, of course not. So we're going back to ice. Allow me. I will not hold back. Wait. 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 Oh, that makes sense, yeah. You saying I'm not fast? <laughs> so this is probably what you meant about turning it back to night. So I'll kill these, kill these dudes. Oh, I was just kidding. Don't worry. I am slow. Um, Don't you spider web me, because I'm going to cross catch you. Cool. Is everybody back to not poisoned? Don't keep me waiting. Okay. Whew. All right. I've never just had it turn on me here, so I didn't know they are they red at night. Line was serious. I was supposed to sound like a squealing. Okay. So, let me go ahead and use some item. Do I even... Oh, what if I don't have one? That sucks. Well, whatever it is, I don't have it equipped. Let's see. While I'm here, I should probably give some candies to Reese. And go into items. Gonna... Dream read? Yep. And I don't want the gold item seed on my bar. Cool. All right, so now. Hope this is okay. These huge lamp blooms are extraordinary. Shall we search these woods for the Elfin Kingdom? I think we should. Anything but ordinary. But those ones are red too. Oh, that must be because down. I came from that way. All right. Ah, oh, flip. They seem really comparable. I like don't think there's an edge on Ice Smash Plus versus Dark Dark Plus, whatever it's called. Eh. Stop hurting me, bro. Dream Reader. Okay, so that's red. So, I guess I'm going this way. I uh, hope that was right. Let's take it out. Get out. <laughs> he 
He's got one HP left, and they're all just like, do 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 do. Oh, nice, more Jackbox. Don't kill me, bro. I know I'm being a little sloppy, but whatever. Here, I'm going to wish her cups something. Cool. Let's uh, swap to somebody who can do some stuff. Oh, they all have shields. I didn't even fucking notice that. Right, he has nothing, right? Camera, wake up. Caterpie is dead. Ah, oh, maybe that'll be the first game I play back on the East Coast with the D-pad, because that's when I'll be there. Um, let's see, this is the way. Hey, that wasn't too bad. I bet there's gonna be an encounter, though. Hey, a cactus. What up, Sea-Doo Gamer? Hello! Thank you for coming by. Just about to discover the secret Elven Kingdom. Get the last, um, elemental dude, man, guy. Um, let's see. Is this important? No? Kind of felt like a good time for them to put magic water or something, you know? No Jackbox until you finish Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog? Yeah, right. <laughs> we'll do it, but we have a lot bigger fish to fry than Sonic cartoons. Although, I'm sure I'm going to walk in the door and Rick is just going to quietly hand me the DVD and nod. And we'll have to do that for four hours, but it'll be good. I do actually enjoy those. They're just like a drag to do a bunch in a row, you know? Because it's zany and funny the first time. But then it's like, okay. <laughs> Dior! So it wasn't Dio. It wasn't Ronnie James Dio at all. Disappointing. Find the Elfin Elder. Alright, how are we doing for time? We can go a little bit longer. Hopefully, we'll see how things go. But we may not get Dryad tonight, huh? <laughs> Another gold item seed. Yay! Maybe they shouldn't have started... I just want you to watch better Sonic cartoons. Yeah, we started with the worst, longest one. But, you know what? That's fine. These are headstones. There are headstones here. Okay. Are those going to be important later? Because it's weird that I can talk to them. And it's just like, this is a headstone. Which you can tell by just, just by looking. I think maybe they shouldn't have started it is the D-pad's motto. Um, or rather should be. What's up, dude? Oh, come on. Say something. Can't have a conversation with these people. Oh, are they being standoffish because they don't like humans? Whatever. I don't like humans either, honestly. Um, oh, come on. I can't even heal. Ooh. Haughty. H-A-U-G-H-T-Y. Alright. I guess I gotta go find the Elder before I can do anything. Oh, that's a... Okay. In the tree. Why would you put the placeholder text in the graves to tip you off is the honest question. Yeah, right? Um, whatever. Oh, this guy lives in a nice place. Built on the backs of his overly taxed citizens, I imagine. Doo -doo -doo. All right, I hope that's not him then. Star here makes me think maybe not. I have nothing to say to humans. Nothing to say to humans, Leave huh? Immediately. Yeah, it's probably it, Oxford. Please. We need your help. Oh, you are the ones chosen by Fairy. I mean, I don't self. want to brag, but yeah, Fairy, Fairy chose me. Yeah. There you are. You went without me. Again. How could you forget about me? 
you horrible man. You told us to go ahead, man. Charlotte. Is that really you? Who are you? Ronnie James Dior. Hmm. You do not remember. You were very young when you were taken to Wendell. I wish I could auto-tune these I not be surprised. very slowly oh, delivered dialogue-heavy so cutscenes. Huh? Wait, no time for that. My, My grandpa, grandpa is sick. Is sick. He needs he help. Needs your please. help. <laughs> please. When the priest of light put up a barrier to protect Holy City Wendell, he used forbidden magic. Whoops. Way to go, priest of light. Do you not have auto-tune? I mean, I have auto-tune at my disposal, mm, I but I don't see. have it hooked up to my I PlayStation. <laughs> I would ever hear tell of the Priest of Light again. It must be Laron and Shayla's will from the world beyond. Getting antsy Papa from standing. Hmm, it became dark yes, outside. When did that happen? Child. Slowly over the last few hours. Good question. Caused Laron and I know, right? Like it's much pain. way darker. Humans now it's like seven than it forbidden to marry. It's just crazy. His eminence and I were against the union. Afraid that Okay. Somebody is a half elf. Sorry I was paying attention but to the conversation. Not the conversation. Love was more important to them than our Sheila Lord. left Dio Sheila and eloped with Laron. Eloped with Laron. Poor Dio. Once I saw their happiness, I reluctantly relented. After a time, they had you. Autumn child. is great. You should all get a portrait if you're a New Englander well, in the they fall. They this world thereafter. Yeah, honestly, My that's... Hey, look, they are important. Um, that's exactly why I am going back to New England to when I'm going back. It was like, well, if I ha can't go back every six weeks like I had been doing, I'm going to wait till my favorite time and then just fucking go for a long, long time. in Laron's place. That is when you left Dior for the Temple of Light. And to avoid future tragedy, I sealed Dior away from humans. We too agree only elves And I recommend me as your photographer, but I'm biased. Settled. Maybe sometime. Are you also in New England, Carnium? <laughs> Papa, Mama, way. Whereabouts? Leave her be. Regarding the issue of his eminence's illness, I'm afraid. Is that really it? Is that the end of Charlotte in our playthrough? The of the world Hudson. Yeah, yeah. So, so you're in Hudson Mask? Cool. In the end, it sounds like our only hope is to get the Sword of Mana and ask the Goddess of Mana to heal him. Sir. So the Sword of Mana is just a way to get so the, the Goddess of Mana to do your bitch work? It's what it sounds like. Also, her hand just can clipped through her tell us self. Where we can find the woodstone? Hmm. There is a mana statue in the northwest of Lampbloom Woods. Well, that means there will be a boss nearby, if you probably. If Luna's moon powers at night, the Lampblooms should let you through. A lot of shoulds and tentative sounding language there. Go to the mana statue. Alright. They both only live like another couple of years. Yeah, is that really what he said? That seems very inconvenient. And Charlotte does not seem worth it. <laughs> Sorry. Will y'all talk to me now? Is that how it's gonna be? Holy hell's live in Dior. We live apart from the humans, so it's peaceful. Yeah. Is this not a real door? No, no. What about up here? Once you get to the... I mean, is it is it 15 minutes or less, Alex Britt? Running up against the dinner clock. All right, we'll try it. Let's just take a quick look. Make sure I'm still free to go. Da-da-da. There's gear to get here first, right? Was she just dancing? That's fun. All right, let's get some gear. I see a treasure chest there. Yeah, seems like a bad choice to make for sure. 
Love finds a way and then dies immediately. Which is... Hey, girl. I'm supposed to be looking for my brother. I forgot that until right now. Um... Sure. Helmets and shit. Oh, I hate humans. Why, thank you. I don't blame you. If I fell for something that would take 900 plus years off my life, I would be mad about it. Welcome. Come, take a look. Flamberge. Wasn't that also a Symphony of the Night weapon? Always good to have a spare. Always good, good. to have a spare. <laughs> oh shit, I did the thing, didn't I? Damn it! Oh. Fark. Yeah. This is good quality. So this is. Okay. I won't make that mistake I again. Make use of this. this is useful. Well, I wasted a little money there, but I think we'll be alright. I honestly got caught up because Flamberge is a cool name for a weapon. Whatever, I still got 12 grand. I'll, I'll be alright. Um, let's go out. I feel like I've seen Flamberge all over the place. I wonder why Welcome. it's Come, called take that. A look. I feel like I've looked into this. Is it because it's designed in a way to rend skin, so it's a very burning feeling? Can someone look that up? I feel like I've heard that. Or maybe it's that. I don't know where I heard whatever the hell I was just saying then. So this is... Oh, cool. Looks good. Always good to have a spare. This is good quality. Always good to have a spare. And apparently, go to hell, Reese. <laughs> Alright, it also teaches regiment. All three of the Kirby General are named after weapons. Yep. Looks like a flame, wavy blade, the wavy blade would tend to give you more lacerations. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and sell some gear that I no longer need. Buy some stuff for the Reese. Yeah. Always good to have a I had wanted this. I have wanted this. And then if I sell this, can, oh, can I buy it? Take a look. Yes. Always good to have a spare. This is useful. And I can sell my Barboot. Cool. Okay. Well, that's good. But I mean, we got a lot of great stuff. I do feel Come again. much better equipped. So that's good. All right, now I'm going to the star. Flame bladed sword. We're low on money, but it should be good for a bit. Hopefully, yep. Collect CS particles. If you hit an enemy with a power, X, or charge, press and hold, X, attack, the enemy will drop particles that fill up your CS gauge. I think I intonated that wrong. What a horrible fate for elves and humans and love. It's so sad. What would you but know about now, love? We should head to the mana statue. Maybe they won't see me. Son of a bitch! <laughs> I'm sure I've also probably talked about this, but did you know that, like, in the old times, warriors would sit around the campfire at night and they'd throw the bones of their enemies in the fire and put their sword in with it and it would actually make their sword stronger because of the calcification. I read that somewhere. Oh, stop being poisoned. Here we go. 
That would be a cool thing to look up, because I, I remember reading that in a reputable source, thinking that, that was true, or thinking that it would actually be true from where I read it, but I can't remember the details now. Right, it's one of those things that's like they thought it was magic or burnt the souls of their enemies or whatever, but like there's actually a chemical explanation for it, but maybe it's both, you know? Mush eruption. Oh, thank you there. Oh, I don't know. Did somebody just Oh, who has this? Do I not have any MP? Oh, that's why everything sucks right now. I'm trying to read the chat and be decent at a game. Just can't do it. Something must go. Something must suffer. Manja. Okay, so I'm going to use a walnut on this dude. And let's just see where I might want to put this. I mean, I think Int's maxed out. So I might just keep going. Let's see. It's okay, Rick doesn't read the chat and is bad at the game usually. <laughs> I don't know. Rick's, Rick's pretty good. Dave! Hello, man. How you doing? Thanks for stopping by. We're going to stop in a few minutes, but I'm glad you're here. We're going to try and get one more elemental before the night is out. Um, and I'm trying to decide how to spend Sweet Angela's points of training. Stamina would give her survivability, considering I do play her like a tank. Dave's brother Jeff's friend's John, friend, yeah, pretty much, yeah. Uh, I appreciate that, man. I really do. I um, were you guys away for the weekend as well? Um, it's out in Joshua Tree. Let's see. That's all done. That's whatever. Ooh, Holy Ball Plus would be nice. These all seem worth taking. How is San Diego? Anything fun? Luck. Random debuff. Meh. Cyclone plus and luck plus five. What's the matter, Alex Spirit? You gonna tell me I did something wrong? I have Enigma. What's that do? Oh, nice, cool. Um, yeah, friends are nice. It's cool to see them, but difficult logistically. But we should do one of those roof dinners this week. I think we can actually all make it work this time. Oh, that's cool. I'll try Enigma. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm just going to bump up strength because I don't want to think anymore. And I'll go to gear and stats. 5%, uh, 2 MP. Recover 2 of MP when enemy defeated. Yep. Magic damage dealt increases by 5. Sacrifice. I, see, I don't really have the space. Um, that would be awesome. Yeah, I would love that. I don't really have the space for Enigma, Alex Britt. Now it finally makes meeting up with Dave in person work right before he bails on California. Yeah, I'm going to New England in, uh, for a bit in October, Dave. So we have to hang out before that. Jeez. Um, for anyone who doesn't know, Dave and I literally live in the same building, but barely, barely see each other because of pandemic, obviously. Um, all right, let's keep moving. I want to get this done. 5% versus... Enigma. <laughs> no! <laughs> yeah, this, like, pesky little brother I have is like, when can I see you? And I'm just like, ugh, fine. I'm a brother. I'll come visit. So, that's basically it. <laughs> no, I mean, you know, obviously I miss my friends and family a lot, but I also miss my friends and family a lot who are here. So it's just a bad scene all around. And man, traveling and quarantining is a nightmare. I just booked a two-week Airbnb to quarantine, and uh, not looking forward to that, financially. <laughs> Clubbed. All right. So, oh, now Reese leveled up. 
Okay, that seems... <laughs> yeah, um, I would say ankle-sized. I don't have a good way of defining that, but, uh, I would say it's, like, a little bit bigger than my wrist, probably. Or, like, actually, like, quite a bit bigger. I have... I think I have pretty thick ankles, but I have pretty dainty wrists, so I don't know. It's a bit of a head-scratcher there. You're gonna have to come measure it yourself. Wink. Um... What am I trying to give Reese here? Sure. Whatever. Back from Wikipedia after learning Joshua Tree is a place and not just a weird name for a U2 album. I also had that same thought process when I first learned about Joshua Tree the place. I knew the album first, not the park. Um, slash town. All right, let's, let's see what's going on here. Oh, this must be the mana statue the Elder mentioned. It's so different from all the others in this world. Hmm, interesting. I've never seen this plant. I would think in the average ball and chain, but yeah, my nice average size fun. ankle would fit to a I point of average comfort. I think that's fair. See. I think this, this is a totally normal, fair conversation for two bros to be having. I think that's fine. Yeah, man, Luna looks weird. You there missed that you part. Would it be all right for me to take one of you, uh, you missed the part me? where we talked about how strange she looks. <laughs> I think she's meant to kind of be like a I baby wrapped so in a seed, but it just kind of looks slightly yonic and a little weird and like the baby's head is squished and I just, I'm not into it. Not loving that design. Okay, so we got the seed, or... Why is she inside a giant cannoli? I prefer Dave's uh, interpretation, actually. That's the best one yet. Oh, God. I hate that attack. It's a good thing I got all this badass new equipment, because these guys are wrecking my shit. Um... Here we go. Now I want a cannoli. Leave the baby, take the cannoli, right? Oh good, I'll move right into the path of the attack. What could possibly go wrong? Durin, use an attack! Hooray! Okay. We've I feel like the last part goes without saying nobody. What? Just not with a person inside. Yeah. I mean, it's good that you specified in this case, because I was a little unsure. You never know. Guess I'm gonna go this way. Ooh, I should probably, like, properly heal. E. Ah. Here we go! <laughs> I want candy. You missed all of our Ronnie James Dio jokes. Let's see what else. Um, what else was good from today's stream? We can catch the guys up on. Oh man! If you want to put on two pounds real fast, Wegmans has their a tub of cannoli filling and cannoli shell chips. Holy shit! Wow. Talk about racists and how they're bad. I think you should probably specify that, you know, part. Um, but it was really me. Dio. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, I'm still hung up on the uh, cannoli part, though. So just to be clear, you get a... I'm going to picture a bucket of cannoli filling and a bag of cannoli pieces shell cannoli shell pieces and you just dip them in like chips and dip that's terrifying yeah I, i'll bring that back on the way i'm sure nobody will be suspicious of me bringing a bucket of cannoli filling on a cross country flight Quite that far off. Imagine you're. 
Oh, yeah, that's a problem. And believe these can only fill in inside other pastries. In my country, it would be. No, uh, I think that would be encouraged. To the nth degree. Oh, you're still alive? Oh. Oh wow, you can go to the Wegman's website, huh? I'm gonna look at this as soon as this stream is over. I'm gonna act like I didn't, because I, I wouldn't be tempted by that, I eat healthy. <laughs> okay. That was a lie. I, I, I try and fail to eat healthy would be more accurate, I think. Ooh, a save point with, with healing, which means something's gonna happen. And I mean, you can say, no, it's fine. I just have some friends who really love cannoli. Yeah, I think they're gonna... Uh, one time I tried to bring back a little thing of walnut butter, and they took it away and threw it away. I was like, God, it's clearly walnut. Like, what am I gonna put in walnut butter? It was this big. <laughs> hey, John, what do you call imperialism done by Italian bakers? Canolialism. Ah, I was right! <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh man, I was trying to like work out how I would pronounce it in my head, but we got there. Um, man, because of the chat delay, you're just gonna think I read it, but I really did come up with it myself. <laughs> um, but I can still lose to a cannoli ditch. That's a really good point, Cardium. That's highly true of, I think, any of us, even the best of us. Oh dear. Is this a friend? I don't think it's so much... Okay. Well... First... I'm just gonna cheese the blue bottles. You sound very calm there, Faye. Do you do anything, Durin? Come on. Again. Let's see. Um, right leg. Oh, body. Flower. All right. Well, I'm gonna ignore the slope spitters and go right for flower. 291. That seemed useful. Let me go ahead and try again. I don't know if this is the right strategy, but it feels right. Blasting the flower in the head with fireballs doing 300 damage seems effective. This is going to be the kind of thing where I have to kill the legs first. Probably should have equipped fireball rather than menuing it, but at least I can be sure I'm hitting the right person. Person. The right monster. Oh, I can. Oh, can I? There it is. No one's saying anything about my strategy being wrong, so I'm just going to continue doing it, because it's economical and seems somewhat effective. Well, I guess for fun I could try an Ice Blast, actually. Um, let's go ahead and do Ice Smash Plus. It does a little less, but hits the others, so maybe good. The silk splitter was annoying me, so I'm gonna do some more of this. Here, why don't you do this? Okay. Hey, Durin. Before you die, just get you doing some of these. And then maybe one of these, too. Okay, I have to be very careful all of a sudden. So I'm gonna just couple wishes you. And I'm going to chocolate me. Because poison bubble is freaking OP, yeah. That's okay. I wasn't really paying attention to my allies until I realized Durin had so many... Holy... Whoa! That's an uh-oh. That's terrifying. Okay. I don't even think I meant to do that, but that's cool. 
This is cool, and the camera is like smart enough to zoom out now, which makes me really happy. No one mentioned exploding seed. We have to defeat it fast, or this is going to get messy. I think you're right. This thing is terrifying. I don't like this. Planigator is not your friend. Is that what it was used? To? Is that what it used to be called? Hammerbud. So yeah, pretty much every area is red. <laughs> oh, okay. We're making progress, it's just taking some time, huh? Guess I should eat a nut. Nut complete. Uh, let's try a different spell. My smash seemed to be really good, too, but... Maybe you can hit the neck. Is there... Are there, like... Is there an optimal strategy for, like, which body parts to attack, etc.? Button. The head takes the most damage. Okay, that's kind of what I thought. Oh, that's a lot more than it was before. Interesting. I realize Reese died, so I should probably heal her. Oh, that's cool. Ooh, getting down to the wire here in terms of MP. I think I have one more nut. Where'd it go? It was even more impressive as a 2D sprite. Oh, wow. Not at all what I meant to hit, although serviceable damage. I think we're going to make it. It's going to be going to be close. Yeah, final nut. Final nut complete. Alright, I'm just gonna start whacking you. You wish. You be okay. <laughs> that timing was pretty perfect. Ow! My most of me! What's it gonna be? Yes! So many level ups. Wow, we're only, uh, I think, what, two levels away from the next class change? For everyone but Durin? Look, Four. Oh. There. It's 38. Womp. Huh? Elemental Wrangler. Oh, she's so cute! Oh. <laughs> oh, it's just you, Dryad. Chapter 3. How many chapters oh. are there? Yes. Oh, thank I like her little wiggle. Grapplevine. The monster ensnared me in its grasp and has sapped my power for so long. I am too, but you can't really see my hips, which are not lying. That's how it got so big. That's how it got so big. Thank you ever so much. Oh, forgive me for causing you so much trouble. 
We are happy to help. Just jamming out. Uh, will you help us? No, my hips don't lie. I may lie occasionally when the need arises, I'm so but sorry, but that is it, that just is a perpetual pee? Power. Six main, I one post. I okay. No help to anyone right now. I would only Sapped all my power because you're a tree person. A little plant pun. Oh please, you're the wood elemental. You're the most in touch with mana power. Halfway to the credits. Besides, you're still strong after getting stuck inside that weird plant monster. <laughs> You'll definitely be able to help us. Do you also we wiggle your uh, hips incessantly, Oxpert? Are you certain? Yes! Come with us, Dryad! Oh, I'm so nervous. Oh. I got a call from Scam Likely. Thank you. You're too kind. That's what T-Mobile labels. Spam calls, scam likely, but we have a joke that it's like this guy named Scam Likely who's trying to sell you something. Obtain powers from the Wood Elemental Dryad. That's our eighth elemental, right? Uh, okay. Is that in the game? Oblivizel. This is probably our last chance. Hawkeye, got it. Uh, what's Oblivile? That, yeah, what's Oblivile? Neat. Do you anyone else get the feeling that, like, in the past, all the bad the guys are just going to follow us there and get the stuff away. before we do? The whereabouts of Oblivile were erased from oh, cool. everyone's memories. To further protect the, the secret, world. Dryad taught you the equivalent oh, of Flare. But don't worry, it's still there. When I used the last of the mana power in the sanctuary to get to this world, I appeared in the sky above that island. Guess we okay. gotta go there. Let's hurry. Oh, that's cool. I'll be excited to learn those, hopefully, <laughs> if my characters can. Wood elemental magic. Now that you can access Dryad's powers, you can use wood stuff, leaf saber, wall poison bubble. Awesome. And some of those I might even be able to actually get. Open the portal to the sanctuary. All right, guys, and I believe that is it for this episode, so I'm going to save here, heal up. Oh, I'll, I'll do my um, my training before I forget. Um, let me do that now. So if I go to training, I'm just going to put in strength. Reclaim is pretty good, actually. Let's see what this says. So we're cover 2 MP when enemy defeated. All magic dealt increased by 5. Damage increased by 20. Yep. Aurora Sisters Chain increased magic attack by 5 in battle. So these are the same, I guess. Alright, and then Reclaim 2 says... Go up. Recover 2 MP when power... Oh, when power attack... No, that's terrible. Okay, never mind. I'm keeping what I have. Um, and then... Training for you. What do you need? Uh, don't love that. Um, no, no, yeah, I guess stamina. Cool. And then for you, stamina again. All right. Okay, guys, that's actually it. I gotta go. It's dinner time. So I'm gonna save, and I'm gonna head out. Dave, thank you for stopping by. Carnium, Envy, Alexbrit, Golux, Arrow, Dechampster, everyone who's been in here, Sea Dude, really glad you all were here. I love you all. SC Hero, most of all, um, you are all the best, and I had a great time. I'm really starting to enjoy this game, only seven weeks in, or whatever it is. Um, but yeah, this was great. I love you all. I'll keep you updated on how travel plans might affect the stream, but I'll be doing something, and uh, we'll hang out soon. You're all the best. Have a good night. I said that as if I was ending the stream, but I haven't even put down the controller. Here, why don't I do that? Click the end stream button. I'll make it make it a little, a little nice moment here and uh